What else can be said about the adventure genre the famous game designer Friedrich Nietzsche hasn't mentioned already? Nothing. Nevertheless, I'd like to introduce you to the inner world. Join Robert, the extremely cuddly main character, and set out on an epic journey exploring a world which couldn't be more round. But who is Robert? Where will Robert go? And why in the world, Robert? You'll meet folks who not only are able to talk, they even have facial expressions. Adventure experts among you may have already guessed the whole schmear is made in excellent, hand-drawn, non-stereoscopic 2D. The game length is about six to eight hours. With a probability of precipitation of 60%. And for really untalented players, there's an extensive help system, firing more game hints at you than the number of Let's Play videos you can find on the net. Belittlement. A wrongly denounced expression in our modern world is one of the most effective instruments of the adventure genre. Adventures offer the great possibility to deal with topics like dictatorship, theft or murder in a refreshingly unbiased way. Just try it out yourself. <laughs>